Hi, I'm Dr. Leonie Pearson. I work in the water cluster here at SEI Asia. We look at the intersectionality of gender and what that means with all sorts of other issues, such as it's not just women. Women are different. Women are breadwinners, they're irrigators, they're farmers, they um, they have so many different roles they're mothers in life and as such we look at women and how that actually plays out. How do we incorporate that in our projects is actually different for different projects. A lot of the times we prioritise uh, funding women in our projects. We prioritise actually ensuring that there's a gender question within our projects so that even if we take a more mainstreaming approach we've covered off at least for all of our research projects on how to think about women in a different way. By 2030, 50% of the world's population is going to be under water stress. That means they're not going to have enough water. So when we know that women are already underrepresented in their access to water, their rights to water, and their voices heard in water decision making, we actually have to change the status quo. Firstly, we're actually looking at upskilling our technical uh, capacity. So we're looking at trying to find data that's disaggregated so that we understand both community water use, but also about how women use it or how minorities use it or how different ethnic groups use it. The second thing that we're also trying to, you, to do in that sort of technical space is look at doing more analysis and doing using different sorts of data that might be available and seeing if we can integrate it, such as traditional hydrometrological data and putting it with some of the gender disaggregated data that we can find across the country. This is really exciting work. Along with that more technical side, we're doing a lot more stakeholder engagement in our project. So we're actually finding out from the beginning, what are the issues that women need in their water allocations and how can they make sure that they're incorporated in the sorts of data that we collect so we've got data that's useful for women on the ground in water decision making.